Hey, Ronaldo Offerman here of Gearic First. I've been posting some videos and stuff of what I've been doing today on my Facebook, and a lot of you asked exactly if this is for a big show or how exactly we handle our DMX uh, systems for each one of our events. We don't program for each event individually unless there's a particular reason to, such as the beauty pageant we have coming up, or there's a couple of schools that pay for custom programs or weddings, etc. So what happens is, this is Compu Show, this is a system that I have. I program on this board and then I'm able to adapt it for each individual scene. So right now, really what I'm doing is, I'm mapping these four new moving heads. Well, these are the, you know, uh, excuse me, the ADJ Focus Pot 3Zs. I've had these for a while, but I've never actually had a chance to program them. We've been pretty much busking them the whole time with the built-in programs in CompuShell. So now I'm just making sure that they match the same movements and colors as my InnoSpot Pros, as the regular InnoSpot LEDs, the color beams, the uh, scans. So all the lights, when you hit one of these buttons here, they'll go uh, to a particular scene. So if I go here, for example, there's my slow blue sweep for all of them. Now if I go to the next round here, that's my medium. You can see that it changes from slow to medium now, and they all do the same thing. So if I have some one of my guys that don't really use the mouse and keyboard and just want to use this, doesn't matter what system they have or lights, it's already familiar to them. So that's programmed there. Now, of course, there's individual switches that allow you to do modifiers. You can see there's numbers next to it because I have it where you can select your gobos or I can go here into the colors and select your colors. Let me just go ahead and uh, reset that right there. So, yeah, that's how that part goes. So let's say we have an event and I, you know, I'm not gonna be taking the NO color beams or the NO scan HPs or any of those. So how exactly do we just choose the lights that we want? Well, you can easily just close the pages that you don't need, but that'll bog down your computer because it's loading a bunch of lights that it doesn't need. The way the Compu Show works is if I go here and I find my show. So for example, this is my main show here. So I make a copy of my main show, which is dated July 25th, and I delete every fixture that I don't need. And it automatically deletes it from here. So for example, this is Winter Park's prom that I just uploaded on my channel. There's the lights that we use for Winter Park's prom. And the master page, which controls everything, automatically deletes what's not needed. The pages are gone and so forth. But the faders still work the way I had them mapped. So you can see here that I can fade these down. I can do my strobes. Now, how's that possible? We've got tons of different moving heads and such. How does one button map to all of them? Well, I can have this button map to each individual page. But on my master page, let's go here, which is the page that controls everything. There it is right there. On my master page, I got all these little hidden switches here. So there's like all, there's the blackout button, there's the all white, uh, there's the flash, etc. Really, what that does, let me actually shut, put it on at edit mode. You can see there, so there's the flash there. What happens when I hit that button? All the floods flash white and they come down. So it's almost like macro buttons. And it doesn't matter what fixtures I have in here, as soon as I delete them, it just takes them out of that uh, macro or that switch automatically makes it a lot easier so yeah in a nutshell that's how we work everything is all pre-programmed hundreds of different looks for each individual page right there or each individual fixture and then i just delete what i'm not using for each individual show but everything works exactly the same so hours of meticulous programming every time we add a new page so yeah that's essentially how we do our um our uh, lighting programming. If you guys have any questions, comments, etc., make sure to leave them down below. Thanks so much for watching. Good night and God bless.